this is Lulu from As You Wish Pottery and today we will be painting the Day of the Dead Spolvero platter. Here is the supply list. Feel free to pause this section and take notes. Let's begin by tracing the already sketched skull from the tracing sheet to the platter using a marker. Using the Spolvero pouncer, graphite powder, and Spolvero stencil, rub the patterns. Remember that a small amount of the powder goes a long way, and make sure you blow off any excess powder before painting. For a detailed list of all the stencils used in this project, refer to the lesson plan in Dropbox. With this stencil, I was able to place 16 flowers all around the rim. Using a Black Lab Fun Writer, outline all of the details of the Spolvero stencils. With the same Fun Writer, fill in the nose and the spaces next to the cheeks. Outline the flowers on the rim. Begin in the middle and go around the platter. Fill their center black too. Do it slowly so paint doesn't drip down. To paint the bone, use a mellow yellow fun writer. Work on sections, little by little. Use a Jumpin' Jelly Fun Writer for the right cheek flower, for two opposite rim flowers, and for the rim of the left forehead's flower. Use a This Little Piggy Fun Writer for the left cheek flower, the accents on the forehead design, and two opposite rim flowers. Use a Jumpin' Juniper Fun Writer for the forehead design, the rim of the jaw flower, and two opposite rim flowers. Use the Rockin' Red Fun Writer for the chin flower and the two opposite rim flowers. Use a key lime pie fun writer to color the left cheek flower's rim, the inside of the leaves in the center of the skull, two opposite rim flowers, and the right forehead flower. Here I forgot to do a little square in the center of the forehead design. Use the orange peel fun writer to color the top left flower, the outer rim of the right cheek flower, and the next flower in the rim. With an Orange Crush Fun Writer, paint the leaves under the eyes, the next flowers on the rim, dots on the red chin flower, and the design in the forehead. With Jumpin' Jolly, paint the inside of the leaf design. With a Kermit Fun Writer, paint the jaw leaves, the leaves next to the eyes, and random rim flower leaves. Use a Wedge Oak Fun Writer for the inside of the skull's flowers, the tulips, the last rim flowers, and random rim flower leaves. Use Jumpin' Juniper and Key Lime Pie for the last leaves of the rim flowers. Use the back side of a pencil or a Q-tip dipped in black lab to dot the rim of the eyes. Then use a round brush and paint the eyes three coats of black lab. Using three coats of Black Lab and a liner brush, outline the skull. Use a Black Lab Fun Writer to give the skull final details. Use white puffy paint to accent the eyes, the nose, and the spaces near the mouth. As well as placing three little dots around the flowers in the rim. With a round sponge and black lab, rim the platter.
voila, a festive and colorful platter. Thanks for watching.